as an ophthalmologist with a patient with recent onset of ptosis and or double vision you may have to work up the patient for something called ocular myasthenia now what all do you do in the clinic when you do a work up for ocular myasthenia so the first thing is you would look at the motility or look for in which direction there is double vision and if it is consistent or not then you observe the ptosis and the eyelid is the ptosis variable and does the eyelid twitch or go back up when you go from a downward to a primary position that is the kogan lid twitch after this you need to look for the ice pack or the fatigue test so in the fatigue test you make the patient look constantly in an upward direction for about 30 to 40 seconds and you see if the drooping is progressing secondly the ice pack tests will give you an idea after putting the ice pack on the totic eyelid for about 30 seconds to 1 minute whether the ptosis is improving or not if it's improving it's a very very strong and specific indicator of ocular myasthenia after this it would be wise to refer the patient to an oculoplastic surgeon who can further take over the management and do the appropriate blood tests and then get a neurology referral to get the patient treated if the tests are positive if the tests are negative however the patient may just be having an aponeurotic ptosis or another variant of ptosis thank you